Okay guys, all of you have been asking about my hair care regimen. I am in my bathroom, just got out of the shower. Um, okay, some of you are gonna love this, some of you are gonna hate this. You're gonna love it because it's super easy. Some of you are gonna hate it because you're gonna be like, that's it. Um, I don't do much, I'm kinda lazy. Um, just because there's so many other things that I want to be doing, such as making a poyo and dancing and uh, and finding my peers. Cool. So, one, in the shower, when I put conditioner in my hair, I know you're not supposed to brush your hair, apparently, in the shower, but there's no other way. Those of you with curly, crazy hair who have dreadlocks all the time, you guys know what I'm talking about. Like. Brushing my hair outside of the shower is not going to be a thing. So, I shampoo, I conditioner, with the conditioner in my hair, I use a hairbrush like this. I don't use a comb. Um, I just, I, uh, yeah, it takes too long. It takes way too long. Um, so again, time, time is value. Cool. So, brush like this, yes? Sometimes, I really like the square ones too. This one, this one actually broke. I, I broke it when I was away. So definitely try to get a better quality <laughs> hairbrush. Um, granted, I've had this one for a while. So anyways, that was that's one. Two, right when I get out of the shower, I put my product in right away. So my hair is already brushed. As soon as I get out of the shower, I squeeze out all the extra water. Um, so if I were in the shower, I would just come out. I would squeeze everything out like and wring it like a towel, yes. Um, right away from there I would take my got to be glued. As you can see this is used very well. Um, it's super powerful. You don't actually need that much of it. Um, like a little dollop will, and even for my hair. But just make sure that you spread it around, that it goes in the front, in the back, in the side, in the sides, everywhere. Just um, and then when you're doing that, just scrunch, yeah? So a small little dollop. Again, you can use more, usually I use less, and then, and then like about that much, probably sometimes a little bit more, um, but essentially smudge it in my hands, and then I just do one of these. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. Literally just get it everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Alternatively, if I don't have this, then I use the Got To Be Hairspray, and I spray that. Also, when it's wet, like just on the inside, around, and on the outside. I'll show you guys a picture of it also, and I'll leave links down below. Then what I'll do is I will take my towel, wrap it around, just so that when it's really, really, really wet, I can get it out of my face for a little while. Throw it back. Keep it like this for, I don't know. Depends on the day. Depends how fast I have to get ready. Um, but usually I keep it like this for about five to 10 minutes, just while I'm putting on my makeup and stuff like that. Then I let it down, let it loose, and voila! I mean, it's still wet, but that's pretty much all I do to it. Again, if you want a little bit of extra um, bounce and hold and all that kind of stuff, uh, you can put more of the hairspray in when it's completely dry, but I like putting in the product when it's wet because, uh, and again, like if you don't use too much of it, you don't get that wet look. Granted, I think that my hair, if you do have thick hair, it tends to absorb it pretty quickly. So I don't I don't generally get that wet look. I actually like the wet look. Um, but yeah, I don't uh, I don't get that because my hair eats it all. So um, that's pretty much my whole hair care regimen. I know it's really, really simple. I've never been a big fan of mousse. It's always been gel or hairspray. So even when I'm traveling, if I ever get something, even if it's not this one, I really like this because it's super strong, but again, that's my hair is really thick, but if you want to keep those kind of tighter curls, um, 
because my hair tends to wave out also like it becomes a little bit more wavy first day that I do this you know it's pretty curly and then as I sleep on it it tends to do this or when I put it in a ponytail it's just like you know it changes up a little bit you guys all know what I'm talking about long hair problems well technically sometimes it's nice because then you get the curly and you get the wavy so if you have any questions let me know um, I gotta get dressed now but uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. That was my hair care regimen. Again, really, really simple. You could do it in probably 11 minutes because one minute to put this in and 10 minutes to put your towel on or around your head. Um, all right, y'all, so that was it. You saw it, that was my hair care regimen. I will continue like as it dries to <clears throat> him um to continue scratching it p.s i got dressed uh yeah bathrobes off my camera died for a little bit so i got dressed and it's a little bit more dry and as you can see i just kind of as it continues to dry i keep scratching it but i also really don't like having my hair in my face when i'm working so again a lot of long hair people and curly hair people y'all know these clips these are lifesaver. I just like that. I don't have my earrings in yet, but and then I kind of just let it hang and let it dry, and that's my whole routine. So thank you guys for tuning in. I'm gonna take this down. Um, hmm. Yeah, it's just still a little damp. Thanks guys for tuning in. And hope that was helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. If you liked it, let me know. If you hated it, let me know. If you're like, but what about, have you ever used blah, blah, blah? I pretty much respond to everything. So uh, yes, comments is where it's at. And if um, anything wasn't clear about step, shower, brush your hair, put gel in it, scrunch it, Put a towel on, let it dry, let it down, use one of these to keep it out of your face, uh, and just keep scrunching. Scrunch, scrunch, scrunch. That's, this, is, this is the magic ingredient, yes? And a little bit of this. Um, and later on, if you want extra volume later when it's dry, again, you can um, again use the same brand, Got To Be. Uh, I think I actually ran out of it because clearly I use it. Uh, I use it a lot on shoots too, kind of just to spruce it up. So thanks again for tuning in. If you want a tutorial on something else, let me know and I got you. Till next time, peace y'all. Whoop. Wait, I always forget to do this. If you like what you saw or you heard or if you like anything on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Would love to keep seeing you, would love to keep hearing from you. Uh, tell me what you want to hear about and I'll be sure to address it. Leave a comment or a question in the below area where you can do that. And I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great one.